Hello, this is a new feature in Pro Tools 2023.3. It's kind of a small feature, but a big feature at the same time, something that I've been hoping for for a long time. And that is to include rulers with track groups. And you're thinking rulers, what are rulers? Rulers are the tempo ruler, meter, key, chords, more importantly, markers ruler. So in the past, if you made a selection in the timeline, for example, I'll just make a selection here and go to shuffle mode and delete. And I want to close this selection that I've made and move all the audio to the right ahead. If I hit delete, all the audio will move forward, but the markers in the and rulers will not unless I intentionally shift click in each one of those rulers. And that's cool but it's really easy to forget to shift click in the ruler and those rulers will not update with the delete uh, with the shuffle delete right I can do it but with the new feature now I can enable add rulers and I'll do it to the all group you can do it to any track group that you create or include it in the all group include rulers now if I make a selection in the timeline that selection is included in the rulers as long as that uh, group is enabled and then when I hit delete the rulers will update with that shuffle delete right it's a a small thing but a big thing this also applies to copying and pasting not only audio and MIDI on the tracks but of course the rulers that go with it so in this example I'll make a selection I have my all group enabled so this includes all tracks and I have the rulers added let me just verify that yes include rulers is enabled so I want to copy and paste some portion of the timeline and I want to an automatically include the markers, the meter, and uh, let's make sure that I include a tempo change in there as well. So if I just uh, select that, I'll duplicate it. It will duplicate all of those uh, rulers that I've included in the selection. So a very handy thing to, to use, not only for deleting, but copying and pasting. This is particularly helpful for people doing um, editing interviews or podcasts. You may have a long interview, let's say, I don't know, 10, 20, 30 minutes, and you need to edit for content and get rid of uh, a bunch of content to whittle this down to the uh, amount of time that you need. And in the past, again, if you didn't intentionally click in the in the ruler, the marker ruler, those markers would not move with the audio. And of course, those markers would now be useless for the rest of the of the interview. So now if you create a group of the tracks that you want include the rulers this group that I've created here only includes these two whoops I wanted to include the audio one and audio two I don't need click in there now if I make a selection in the audio tracks the selection is extended to include the rulers and if I hit delete not only will the audio move forward, but the, the markers will too. So this is a very handy feature, can save a lot of time uh, in editing long form uh, interviews, podcasts, of course, and it applies to music too. So not only markers, but tempo, meter, chords, uh, key changes, all those things will be included in edits that you make.